morning, thank you for joining us today. Quite a few people have asked about the stole I'm wearing through Lent and asked if I could share what this is about. Well, this is the story of, of Lent, and we follow Jesus through that final week of his life. And it's my uh, privilege to share those stories with you now, the stories of Lent. In our stories of Lent, Purple Stole, the first panel is the Last Supper, where Jesus gives to his followers the gift of Holy Communion and says, when you take and receive this bread and wine, you receive me. In our second painting, the Garden of Gethsemane, the night before Jesus died, he went by himself and prayed that if it were possible that he could avoid the cross of Good Friday. Yet he prayed, not my will, but your will be done. And the next time you're at St. John's, which we hope is sooner rather than later, the beautiful stained glass window behind the altar has that. Not my will, but your will be done. The third painting on this stole, it's the story of Jesus being stripped of his garments by the soldiers and cruelly whipped. The fourth painting on this stole is of Pilate. Jesus was brought to Pilate. The crowds wanted Pilate to convict him, yet Pilate washes his hands and says that he finds Jesus not guilty of any of the crimes for which he was accused, but the crowds could do with Jesus as they wished. In the fifth painting, Jesus is forced to carry his cross. Simon of Cyrene would be recruited to help him carry that cross, but I think this painting is of a Roman soldier since he's in uniform. In the sixth panel, soldiers prepare Jesus for the cross and they dress him in a scarlet robe as a way of mocking him. In the seventh panel, Jesus is cruelly unfairly, unjustly kneeled to the cross. The eighth panel represents Good Friday. And Jesus dies on the cross. And the lettering I-N-R-I in three languages says above Jesus, here is the King of the Jews. The ninth painting would be from Holy Saturday where the Gospels record the two Marys, that's Mary Magdalene and the other Mary, along with Joseph of Arimathea, come to take Jesus from the cross and to bring him to a tomb, a tomb which Joseph of Arimathea, who was a wealthy follower of Jesus, would be giving to Jesus for his final resting place. And the tenth and final panel on this purple stole, the stories of Lent, we once again see Joseph of Arimathea, who gave his grave to Jesus, along with the two Marys again, and what is probably the beloved disciple, John. The stories of Lent. Thank you for joining with me in this time, and thank you for those who've asked about this uh, new stole of mine, purple for Lent and covering the stories of Lent, Jesus in his final days. Let us pray. Almighty God, whose son fasted 40 days in the wilderness and was tempted as we are, but did not sin, give us grace to discipline ourselves in the submission to your service, that as you know our weakness, so we may know your power to save. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and 